What is up guys, it's Whiteout HDX here, and today we're going to show you exactly how to upgrade your set of Force Armor. Now, in the last tutorial, I showed you how to create Force Armor using Leather Armor and a Force Rod, uh, slapping it with a Force Rod and creating and turning it into Force Armor. This tutorial will be exactly how to upgrade that Force Armor to make that armor even better. So, we're going to go up in the house here. And we're going to find all the materials that we may need uh, for this project. And uh, for, first off, what we're going to need is we're going to need a block of obsidian. We're going to need an upgrade, upgrade tier book. We're going to need some kind of switch. And we're going to need a force engine. Or sorry, some kind of engine. It does not have to be a force engine, guys. Some kind of engine to put underneath uh, the table we're going to be making. What we're going to be making is a force infuser. It's a table basically made out of obsidian. The obsidian uh, we will place over top of the engine. I'll show you here. First, I need to get a few buckets of force. Where are they? There we go. I'm going to take three. One, two, three. All right. So after we get the bucket of force, we're also going to need a few force gems. What we're going to do with the force gems, we're going to take the force gems and we're going to stick them in the force infuser. So once we get the, our force rod, we get our obsidian, our engine placed, everything down. We're going to take the block of obsidian and stick it right on top of the engine like so. Once it's on top of the engine, you're going to take your force rod and just right click it just like we did at the armor. And boom. We have it right clicked. We're going to want to take the uh, upgrades home. Stick it in the top box up here. We're going to want to go and uh, take the bucket of force. And we're going to want to stick the bucket of force in the engine and not in the uh, not in the force infuser. So uh, let's do that here. Last one. There we go. Alright, now next thing we're going to need is some force gems like I said before. It's already on. We're going to grab some force gems out of the box over here. We're going to take the force gems. We're going to stick those inside of the force infuser, creating liquid force for the force infuser. Now, your first step, there's only really one upgrade you can do on the first step, the first tier of your armor, and that would be speed. So, what you're going to want to do for speed is you're going to want to stick your armor in the center. And then you're going to want to take some uh, some sugar. You're going to want to grab some sugar. You're going to want to stick it in one of the slots around the around the armor. So you grab the sugar. All, you don't really want to use claws. Claws will work for your, for your armor. Or sorry, not your armor. Your swords and things like that. And your tools. But you want to click the go button here. And you'll uh, see a bunch of sparks and things. And it'll make a little bit of noise coming out of the force infuser. Once you put the sugar in, it's going to give you speed. So your armor is going to make you a lot faster while roaming around the map. And that makes it a lot easier to get from one place to another, point A to point B. We're going to do the same thing here with the booties. We're going to stick some sugar on it. And that's going to make you so much quicker. Once this is done, I'll show you exactly how much faster you can be with this force armor. Now, uh, you can add claws to your, uh, to your tools and to your to your weapons like I said before that uh, just upgrades the damage after you upgrade your your armor with the with tier one you won't be able to stick it back in the fuse infuser until you have another upgrade tome which is another one of them blue books there now as you see my armor that I have on already has speed enabled or applied to it I haven't got to the other tiers on this server yet on this world but here's how fast you can go you can get across the map pretty darn quickly guys this, this is a great way to move around the map, a great way to get away from mobs very quickly, and uh, it's just a really cool mod. I love the force mod, I love force, I love force armor, force tools, force uh, force swords, they're, they're, they're great, they're a great addition to this mod pack. But guys, if you enjoyed this, this is White Oak HDX, and please click that subscribe button, go over to my Twitch channel, click that follow button. I live stream uh, all kinds of Minecraft, including FTB. Uh, so yeah, the, guys, this is White Oak HDX, and I am out. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, click that subscribe button. Later, guys.